Hi everyone, in this video we are going to cover a very simple concept that is function of complex variables. Actually to represent it, two planes are required here, get it? So the first plane we call it as Z plane, okay, so let me write here. Yes, so we call it as Z plane and the second plane we call it as W plane, right? So this is our W plane. See Z plane has two axes, real axis, imaginary axis we denote it by X. Imaginary axis is denoted by Y and for a W plane, its real axis is denoted by U and imaginary axis is generally denoted by V, okay? So here S is basically subset of complex plane, getting? So suppose we have a set S like this. This is the S which is subset of complex plane or you can say it is a subset of Z. Here for each point Z in S, there is one point in this complex plane W and we call it as W, getting? And we denote it as W is equal to f of z that means for each point in s we will have its image in a w plane getting and let me write here it is denoted as it is denoted as w is equal to f of z okay so we write in this way so we are already familiar with uh, functions of real variables similarly we can define functions of complex variables now, let me use few examples. First is f of z is equal to e raised to z. So we are familiar with f of x is equal to e raised to x. Similarly, we define uh, function of complex variable. f of z is equal to sin z. f of z is equal to cos z. You can take some polynomial function also. f of z is equal to z square plus 2z plus 2. So in this way, we can define any a function of complex variables okay so point is over make a screenshot of it then we will stop thank you see you